so much. You're very kind. Nick and Sally love to learn about different kinds of animals. Did you know that most owls sleep all day and stay up all night? They're called nocturnal because they're awake while you and I are sleeping. Can you think of another animal that's nocturnal? A bat. Right. Bats are nocturnal too. Isn't it fun learning new things? You can learn more about animals with the cat in the hat at pbskids.org. And up next, it's a reading adventure with Super Y. Hi there, Dot here. Creative kids just like you have been making cool things at pbskids.org. Take a look. Keegan, a kid just like you, sent in this story. Let's see what he made. I have a dog named Gilligan. He's a Jack Russell Terrier. Gilligan is funny. We play tug of war with his toy elephant. I love Gilligan and he loves me. That was fun. You can do great things too at pbskids.org. Look who's coming your way every weekday. <gasps> Wonderific. Isn't that amazing? Perfect. <laughs> Catch all your PBS Kids friends weekdays and anytime you want at pbskids.org. Under the Sea, Friday, August 20th on PBS Kids. Let me see. One plus one is two. Four plus four is eight. Three plus three equals six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I just keep practicing and then, like, I just figure it out. We now rejoin our regular programming, already in progress. Hi, it's me, Hooper. Can you guess where I am today? First clue is I'm visiting a place where people come to see animals, but it's not the zoo. And here's another hint. There are lots and lots of fish in this place, but you can't catch them. Oops. Now here's the final clue from the dinosaur train. There they are. Whoa. Great clue. You can look at the fish through glass. <laughs> Now let's go over those clues. I'm visiting a place where people come to see animals. Lots of them are fish. And you can look at them through glass. So, did you guess where I am? That's right, I'm at the aquarium. Hey, fishy, fishy, fishy. Wild Kratz is made possible by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting. And by contributions to your PBS station from viewers like you. Thank you. Wild Kratz.